On 15 June 1897, Mr. R. M. Chart, the vestry clerk, submitted a report to the Mitcham Parish Council. I beg to report on the numbering of houses in this parish as follows. They are in the parish altogether some 2,365 houses. Very many of these are scattered would not fall in with any general system of numbering, nor does it appear to me at present, with so many intervening spaces of unoccupied land, that a complete system of numbering such as is applicable to towns could with any advantage be carried out, and if carried out now it would require very frequent amendment and alteration. There are, however, streets in the parish in which numbers already exist, but which are improperly numbered and create great confusion in the delivery of letters, in the voting lists and other like business, where the houses are too small to be known by distinctive names, and they should be taken in hand at once, and I append a list of such streets to this report. With regard to the general system, I recommend such a one as adopted in London, where all streets and numbers commence at the end of the street nearest to St Paul's Cathedral. And in the parish I should adopt the vestry hall at the centre, and number the houses in such streets as are to be numbered from the end of the street nearest to the hall, taking the even numbers on one side of the street and the odd numbers on the other. With regards to Church Road, this seems to be some difficulty, as it extends there as now named from Hall Place to Single Gate, the houses being for the most part on one side of the road only. It has always seemed to me that this road requires dividing by distinctive names before it is numbered, and the same thing applies to the London Road, which is nearly two miles in length. Perhaps the committee will consider this.